Okay, I got the ESC done as far as the waterproofing and getting ready to install it into the boat. It came out real good. I don't know how well it'll show up on the camera, but uh, this DP273M Scotch Weld Epoxy really sealed up the board nice with just a single coat. And the heat sink has been permanently attached to the top of the MOSFETs after they were sanded. And uh, I sanded the epoxy off the MOSFETs and sanded into the MOSFETs just a little bit. And then sanded the uh, aluminum water block and attached it with the two-part ceramic-based um, Arctic Silver Alumina heat sink adhesive. That's a permanent bond. It'll never come undone. And... This uh, this power plant right here, the motor's a 2858 Tacon, uh, 2618 kV. I'll be running it on 3S through this 60 amp controller, and it's going to be going into a vintage antique Grappner Hydro Speed. This boat's from about 1986. Very cool boat. Um, my first RC boat, and I've had a couple along the way. They've come and gone, but this one's always hung around. This is a very, very simple boat, but it's also a very effective boat when it comes to uh, being downright fast. Not much to see right now. That's what the whole cavity looks like. And we're going to take another shot of it once the uh, electronics are put into place. And we're going to take it out to the lake and see how things go.